our 2015 Coastal Carolina football class uh, by position. We have seven offensive linemen, five defensive linemen, two quarterbacks, two defensive backs, a linebacker, two tight ends, and two specialists. And nine, nine from South Carolina. Now, four of those guys are local right around here in this area. said, we have one commitment here, uh, Coastal Carolina football, and that's literally to put a team on the field that anybody connected with Coastal is going to be proud of. And we want the guys that can play and have the best character. This is what we believe here. To be a great, a great nationally competitive college program, I don't care if you're BCS, I don't care if you're FCS, I don't care if you're Division II, Division III, NAIA, I think there are two things you've got to be able to have. I think the first one is you've got to win. If you don't win, you don't really have credibility. And I think the second thing at the college level, it's about preparing your guys for what the life is going to be like after football is over. It's about life after football. The reality is if you're good enough to get to the NFL, we'll get you to the NFL. But the average tenure in the NFL is about three years. So, so what I talk to the guys about and what I talk to the families about and what we talk to at uh, the heart of our recruiting program is this idea of life after football. So, and most of our guys from the time they've been little kids were told football's just like life. You get the football piece right, everything else follows. The reality is football piece, football's not like life. Football's not life. Life is worried about your parents, worried about your family, worried about your career path, worried about somebody that's sick who you love, worried about the threat of terrorism to our country. That's life. Football's a game. It's a great game. It's an outstanding game, but it's a game. We don't win. I'm going to get fired. But it's a game. It's a game. And this idea, you get the football piece right, this all works. We actually go the opposite of that. We think, how sad it is, is it? And this happens too often in college, college football today. They get the football piece right, but they don't do a good job in the life after the football piece. I find that incredibly sad. So what we do is we try to get the life after the football piece right, and we spend a lot of time on that. You know about our life after football sessions over the span of the season. And if we get that right, we truly believe, we truly believe that the football piece is going to follow. I feel pretty good about we're trying to recruit people of character. And when you really do that, and you emphasize that, and you do that from the beginning, and you don't put a gun to somebody's head, normally they're with you at the end, and they're frankly the guys you want later on.